Buckle your seatbelts and prepare for one epic thrill ride in next weekend's review, Ford vs. Ferrari. You ain't gonna wanna miss it. It's gonna be one fast movie review. Peace out. Hey, you're listening to Noah's Hottest Movie Reviews right now, live. All right, hey guys, I'm just heading into the beat goes on right now. It's a music movie store, and I'm gonna get some movies for my movie review channel. So here we go. I'm really excited, and I'll see you guys in there. Peace, here we go. All right, guys, we're in the store, and I'm just trying to pick out some movies in here for my next movie review, so here we go. I don't even know what to get. You know what I should get? Guys, they got two for six in here. This is so crazy. Seriously, guys, so hard to choose. They have so many freaking damn movies in here. They don't even check for over here. Maybe we can get, get some DVDs over here, two for six. And over here. Of course, we got all the kids' movies over there. We so, yeah, I'm just trying to find these guys, and yeah, it's just really hard to decide in here. All right, guys, so I'm just outside right now. I didn't buy anything. Okay, guys, I have to be the biggest freaking idiot in the entire world. Hold on a minute. All right, I have to be the biggest idiot in the world. So I've been trying to sell some movies on Kijiji so I could get some um, money for them. But I'm just like, all right, sorry guys, I had to take a call there. Um, so yeah, I'm the biggest idiot in the world. Like, I can't believe that all this time I've been thinking that like people are gonna buy them on Kijiji. I could have just taken them there and sold them for like five bucks. Oh my God. I have to be the biggest freaking klutz in the entire world right now. So yeah, I'm gonna basically head home right now, and then I'm gonna head back out here, and I'm gonna sell all those movies. All right, I wanna get out here ASAP, because the guy there said that they stopped selling after eight. So yeah, I could've just sold those movies, guys, for like $10. I could've sold them for like 40 bucks there. And I could just basically buy like all new ones. Ugh. Some days, some days, some days. I just wonder where everything goes. All right, so yeah, I'm gonna, I'll be back in like an hour or so. You know, when I get home, I'll film. So I'll see you guys when I'm at home. Peace out. All right, guys, so I'm just walking back to the bus stop. Got a whole bag of movies right here we're gonna try to sell. It's all those movies that I was trying to sell but didn't make any money for them or didn't haven't been able to sell them. So now that I know this place, accepts used movies 
we're gonna go and attempt to sell these and we're gonna get a whole new ton of movies to do reviews on. So here we go, let's do this. All right guys, so I just got back to the beat goes on and we're gonna try this again. I got the movies that I was supposed to sell on Kijiji that I feel like a complete idiot for even doing. And yeah, we're gonna go in there, we're gonna trade them and I'm gonna see what I make and then we're gonna trade them in for some new movie review movies. So here we go. I'll see you guys in back of the store. Peace. All right guys, so I'm in the store right now. The guy's literally just checking them right now and I'm really hoping I make something off these movies. Because honestly, there's some movies in there that I've never even touched. So I'm really hoping that some of them are worth something. So wish me luck, guys. All right, guys. So I just left the beat goes on right now. I was able to sell four of the movies that I had with me. So just walking back to the bus stop now. I was able to get two new movies in return on Blu-ray for four old movies I traded in. So the beat goes on. You guys should check it out. It's on Upper James Street. Just type in the beat goes on Upper James. Like, guys, I'm not even going to lie. This place literally has every single movie you could probably think of and they have like a two for six deal i mean i didn't a lot of the movies in there i it's like i've either seen them or i've already i just they don't i don't show interest in them two of the movies though that i did that did stand out to me that i have have been wanting is unfriended you guys probably know what that one is i'm pretty sure everybody knows and then i was able to get hall pass with Owen Wilson, so I'll show those movies off when I get home. But yeah, I was able to trade in four older movies and get two newer ones back on Blu-ray. So we got some new movie reviews coming, guys. Stay tuned, and I'll see you when I get home. Peace. All right, guys, so I'm just on the bus right now heading home, and I'm going to show off what I got when I got home. So this is going to be pretty awesome. Let's do this. Peace out. All right, guys, so I'm upstairs now. I got the bag here, and I'm gonna show you guys what we got. Here we go. So yeah, got the bag, and I'm gonna show off what we got. So here we go. So yeah, the beat goes on. We got, we went to the beat goes on, and we got some new movie reviews here, or movies to review. All right, here, I'm gonna show you guys what we got. Alright, so first movie we got here is Hall Pass, and second movie we got is Unfriended. So yeah, comment down below which one of those you guys want me to review, and I'll definitely be reviewing that. Actually, I'll put a poll up right now, after I head back downstairs. So yeah, I'm going to do this, and yeah, I'll see you guys next time. So that's going to do it for the video, guys. Thanks for watching. Be sure to stay tuned for our next video that's going to be coming up here in a few minutes. So if you're just tuning in now, we will be doing a review of End of Watch. That's the movie that won out today. So thank you so much, and I will see you guys in the next review. So here, let's do this.